Uh, okay, yes, thank you. The doctor is on her way. How are you feeling? Well, better. A little more rest and some tea, and I'll be as good as new. Make that a lot more rest, Alfred. You're hurt. The only thing hurt is my pride. Which, sadly, even the doctor won't be able to fix. You can put up a strong front, but I'm not leaving your side until the doctor arrives. Got it? Understood. Be straight with me. When you told me Alfred wasn't doing well, is this what you were talking about? I hoped that would remain discreet. This is not something you hide, Al. How worried should I be? You don't need to sugarcoat it. I just need facts. It's nothing to worry about. Yes, quite right. So let's please talk about something else. Yeah, I'm sorry. It's just there's a lot more to worry about right now than me. So, Bruce, um, after our little talk at your office, I had an idea. There's something I want to show you. So, I've been working on this in my spare time. I remember you said you could use the help, you know, when you're Batman. I started thinking about a tactical suit, in case I'm ever needed in the field. para aramid synthetic lining. Photo-adaptive suit coloring. Full-spectrum, full-surround, heads-up display. I should be able to get the mesh fabricated in no time. I'm getting ahead of myself. The last thing you want is me out there on the rooftops with you. This wasn't all just about me. You've been going up against some heavy opposition, Bruce. More than usual. Alfred told me how Bane nearly killed you. So I designed you this. That's a gun. Let me read you the specs. Batman doesn't use guns, Tiffany. You mean, at all? I guess I've never seen you use one. But I didn't realize that was, like, a rule. I hate guns, Tiffany. Ever since I was a boy. I forgot. I'm sorry. Still, criminals are always trying to kill Batman. Are you telling me you've never once considered a gun? Just to even the odds. It's a no-brainer. This is a bit of a sensitive subject for Bruce. Of course. Sorry. I'm just... trying to learn. Listen, I should have thought it through more. I just got so caught up in the design, I didn't... I have a lot left to learn. No, don't be so hard on yourself. to go. We'll be waiting right here. Well, there is something else. I know this isn't the best time, but I need your advice. Director Waller's people reached out after the incident at your office. They said they were impressed with my skill set. We got to talking, and well, they offered me a job with the agency. 
the training would start immediately. But it'd be a big step for me. I thought you might have some insight. I've been working with the agency, so let me warn you. Waller's dangerous. Yeah, I've done my research. I know she's got a bad rep. But maybe we need dangerous people for dangerous times. This isn't what your father would have wanted for you. I think he'd be proud. I'd be using my skills to fight crime. To protect others from losing their loved ones. Wayne Enterprises? It's hard there, Bruce. I see my dad in every hallway. I hear his laugh around every corner. And you, you're not around. I'm left to myself, with shadows and ghosts and secrets. Waller's tough, I know that. But she is ready to take me under her wing. She knows how to get things done. Alfred's right. Don't make this mistake. Okay. I trust you. You know them better than I do. So what's the deal? If you think they're such bad news, why are you working with them? Are they pressuring you into it? I mean, you seem like you do what you want. So maybe there's something going on that I don't know about. <laughs> no. Nobody pressures me. Yeah, I've noticed. Bruce, just... Just let me in. We used to be so close. Oh, for heaven's sake, Bruce, just tell her. Tell me what? This is why I need to try something new. Alfred needs to rest. He's had a very rough time. If you can't trust me, I don't know why I should listen to you. At least Waller and her people want to work with me. You just want to shut me out. And that's sad. It's really, really sad. Consider this my notice. I'm accepting the agency's offer. I have to go. We'll be waiting right here.